also, speaking of creating change at mm. universities, you are now creating a ma uh, major initiative at West Virginia around strengths, Absolutely. where every student can get in touch with their own top five strengths and learn and grow around those. Can you talk more about what is that and also what inspired it? Well, two things. One is the fact that um, as we're going through this transformation of our university, I want to focus on three things. One, I want to put students first. Unfortunately, too often we don't put our students first. It's, we organize universities for the convenience of those of us who work there. Secondly, of all, I want to be fiercely land grant. I, I want to. I, I want to believe that Abraham Lincoln, if he were alive today, would say, now that institu institution is doing what I think it ought to be doing rather than kind of having uh, filtered away in another way. And the third thing is differentiation. The strengths program plays into all of those. It puts our students first by helping them to understand who they are and helping us understand who they are and helping us uh, develop strategies to play to their strengths uh, wherever they find themselves. Secondly of all, on the land grant, uh, on the land grant side of it, what it really does is, I think the Strengths Finder, uh, the, the whole Strengths program, uh, is all about building communities. It's, it's, it's not, uh, you know, you may not think about it this way because you guys are so immersed in it. But to me, what I have really enjoyed about about uh, about the, the Strengths program is I've gotten so emergent is the fact that it really is about building communities. It's about, it's about people um, coming together with different strengths and figuring out how they can work together. And I think that that's so immensely important. And the third thing is differentiation. I, I want to be, I, I, I want Gallup to be our partner and uh, in de developing a demonstration project that a large public university in a small state that is rural can um, develop a program in which we really use what you have learned as an organization on how we can improve the quality of life for people in ways that no one else is thinking about. I mean, it's pretty simple. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm very driven by that notion of being, being a demonstration prog project, being unique, and using what we learn with our partnership with you to take to the world. What's the difference between a graduate who hasn't necessarily identified their strengths, what it is that makes them great, and a graduate that has? I think, I think the ones who graduate uh, um, without having really thought about these things, that they, that what they do is they, uh, they float. They float from thing to thing. They're not quite certain. They're not, they don't have confidence. They're not, they're, they're not clear about what their objectives are. They're not clear about who they are and what their, what their purpose in life is. I think the students who are going to graduate from our institution with our strengths program are going to be confident. They're going to be humble. They're, they're going to know that they have a calling that is bigger than them. That uh, uh, They're going to know that um, if, they, if they follow that calling, that they can really make a difference in the world.